Well, hello everyone, and welcome to another edition of Talking Bullion. I got another package in the mail. Picked this up from eBay. A little collection I've been working on. Talked about this here recently in one of my videos and on the live stream. But this is going to complete the project I was working on. So why don't we go ahead and take a look. Alright, so let's cut this thing open. See what we have in here. And there you go. 2019 United States Mint Silver Proof Set. But nope, that shouldn't be what's in there. Why don't we see what is in here? Dump them out. We have two sets of the 2019 quarters. Yeah, last time he sent them like that too. That's why I uh, knew what to expect. So let's turn them over. This one's upside down. They're actually both upside down. Take a closer look here. Get my lights off them. Zoom in. See, it says 2019. So some of you may know I'm working on a complete roll of 999 U.S. Mint quarters. So this will be what I needed to complete that goal. So there's 40 quarters in a roll. So that means I need either 40 of the 2019s or I need uh, 40 of the 2020s or a combination of both. You can see this one has a pretty good scratch on it. You can see it's an S mint right there. You see the S. And they are proof. You can see my finger reflecting off that mirror finish. So beautiful proof coins from the US Mint. Up until 2018, these coins would have been 90%. But beginning in 2019, they started making them in 999. Fine silver. I always like that Guam quarter. Pretty cool. We're in the Pacific. So what I'm planning to do is I'm going to break these out of the lenses, which most people have said they didn't want me to do. And break them out of the lenses with these other six packages that I happen to have here. And I'm going to put them in a roll. And of course I'll labor that roll to make sure that uh, uh, we know what it is. I'm just going to put it in a, in a quarter. Roll. And that's my plan. So six of the sets are 2019. And then I have two 2020s. I would have liked to have had two more 2020s to make them half and half. But the deal is, is that the U.S. Mint upped the price of the 2020 Mint a few months ago. And it made the sets cost a lot more to purchase. So I thought I was buying them to break them out of the lenses and I didn't care about the CFAs or anything. I didn't want to be paying a premium for the box and for the set. So I was able to get these before they went up and then uh, got six of the 2019s. That's okay. We'll have uh, a whole roll of 999 fine silver. And I'm going to put it into a just a regular quarter roll. Same roll I use for my guardhouse boxes. Nothing fancy. Just gonna pop these eight lenses open and put them into a roll. And just, you know, as being a stacker primarily, just trying to get a little bit more on the collector side and thought it'd be cool to collect a roll of these silvers. Quarters. So that's what we're gonna do. These things are pretty nice. It'll be interesting to bust them out. I'm thinking about doing a live stream when I break them open. Just having some people join me. Um, figure out how to get them open. Because on the last video I tried to 
break one of these lenses open is this one. You can see it's got some cracks on the tabs there. But I wasn't able to wasn't able to break it too easily, so see, maybe we can tell the difference here. This one down here hasn't been I haven't tried breaking that one open, so a couple of people gave me some advice on how to get them open, but uh, you know, I don't want to be cutting myself or doing anything dangerous along the way, so we'll have to figure it out. Maybe we'll figure it out together during a live stream to see what we need to do to get, thing, get these things open. Well, just a short video today. Just wanted to show you that I got the last two lenses I was waiting for. Thank you for watching. And always remember, let's keep talking boy on.